Aaron, right, now game below 500. Just how frustrating has this entire road trip been, knowing where you had an opportunity to possibly gain some ground, and now you guys find yourself in an even tougher spot? Yeah, I think we're excited to get back home, you know, get past this road trip. You know, it didn't go the way we wanted to, but, you know, like I said, we got we got work to do. We got the work to do. You know, we got an off day coming up, and time to reset and get back to it. You know, we're just a couple streaks away from being right where we want to be. Considering the circumstances, how badly do you feel like this team needs an off day right now? I, I got no idea. You know, I'm not even not even thinking about that. Um, you know, off days are great. You know, great time to reset. But um, I think what we need is more games. More games. You know, if we could play two, I'd rather do that. You look at tonight, the pitching kept you guys in it. You weren't able to muster really anything uh, offensively. How did Charlie Morton keep you guys off balance? Mixing his pitches, you know, he does a great job with um, you know, that fourth team, you know, kind of curveball mix he has in the past couple of years. He's added that little cutter in there and change up. So I think he just kind of kept guys off balance all night and kind of in between. And, you know, when you're sitting one pitch, you're getting another one. So, you know, just this guy's a little off balance. We just couldn't get that, you know, string those hits together when we needed to. You joke about wanting to play more games yesterday. You said, you know, there's not a lot of time left. Do you worry that there's not a lot of enough time left to make this one? Not really. I worry about that when the season's over with. You know, like I said, we try to focus on what we got today. You know, and today's over with, and so I got to focus on tomorrow and the upcoming game. You know, because we got a big series coming up here at home on the weekend. So, um, you know, if I'm sitting here trying to count the days, and you know, <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna be in trouble. So, just focus on what we got right in front of us, and you know, go from there. You sense guys getting deflated at all with the, the scoreless innings piling up? Yeah, I think I think it weighs on some guys because guys maybe trying to go up there and do a little little too much and you know get that big hit and you know try to get a three run homer with nobody on base. But you know, that's part of the game, you know. But I think I think going home, getting a little reset and get back out there. I think the boys are going to be ready, you know. So I think just like like Skip said all, all year, it's right in front of us. So we got to go out there and go out there and take it. When you've got some guys who do have a history of, of producing and, and putting runs on the board. What do you do other than just show up tomorrow to, to sort of get it to where guys produce the way they're used to? You know, that's it's, it's a good question, you know, but I think majority of those guys, it's just getting opportunities. You know, keep getting opportunities. Keep getting guys on base. Keep working the count. You know, I think eventually we're going to pull through, you know, because I got faith in every single guy in this room that they're going to pull through when, they're, when their name's called. You know, if it's getting a rally started, if it's, you know, coming up with a big hit, if it's coming out of the bullpen and, you know, holding the lead for us. So uh, we just got to keep that faith. You know, I think that's what it comes down to is, you know, trusting everybody in this room. You know, there may be some doubt outside this room, but, you know, inside here, you know, we're, we're ready to go. We're locked, ready to go. What do you see results-wise? What does give you faith that this can be turned around? You know, guys have done it year after year, you know, and I think that's what it kind of comes down to. And, um, you know, we've seen spurts of it throughout the year here where we kind of get on a hot streak. But, you know, we're still looking for that, that long, that long hot streak that we haven't really gotten all year. So, you know, no better time than now.